What's up guys? We're back with another video. Today I'm gonna show you guys how to tame an Equus. Now I already found a pretty decent level. Sadly it's not gonna come out as a 202 or anything. Uh, can't remember what 130s come out but anyway first you're gonna want to grab some rock edit. The kibble is I think it is simple kibble if and I think I'm correct. It's simple kibble and then you can give them meteor berries, but that ruins their timing effectiveness a bit. And then rock it is the second best option. So I've then come to this area right here on Ragnarok. Let me grab my uh, GPS. Here's the coordinates. And here's the map. In the highlands. And then all you do is once you have the rock edit, just put it onto your hotbar. Now, I found a way that is pretty easy to do. You just don't even have to be sneaky. So put it onto your hotbar. Uh, where's that 130? I think that one's it, right? Uh, no, 55. Okay, um, that's it. No, that's a 95. Where's the 130? Oh, there it is. Okay, so first, make sure that it doesn't gonna face you. Um, not gonna face you. Run up to it, feed it, get on to it, and then just keep on feeding it like that. Now make sure you don't mess up almost like I just did. I gave up. I gave one, and then I was up at its butt, and I couldn't mount it instantly. You wanna make sure you go onto the side to make sure you do actually mount it. Then you'll see there is a little mini game on the effectiveness 100 and how much levels is that? 40 I think, not sure, can't really see. No, sorry, it's 64 levels. So then you just keep on feeding it. Every time you, if he wants a new feed, there will be something up on that uh, icon there at the bottom and he will do that. Now just keep on doing this as you're running. And it will be pretty easy to tame. Like, it's not much of a struggle. And the same is for Unicorn to do the exact same. It's very good and fun, to actually. Just make sure that it doesn't run into predators. Last time I remember, they don't take damage while you're doing the minigame. And they get attacked by something they run into. So, you guys just want to maybe make sure about that on a low level there we go he's tamed this is a 194 perfect tame here you guys go here's the stats pretty damn good now this is not its base speed let's m just put some of my stuff away and i'll show you guys the base speed okay i think i put most of the stuff away i mean not that i can see anything else now nah, I'm gonna have to put stuff away. Let's just put stuff into him. Okay, I ended up putting most of my heavy stuff in there. Yeah, this will be most likely your Equus full speed when running. Most likely, because this thing is not really overweight anymore. Now, let's see the damages that this thing can do. Here's a Pteranodon. So first, I think let's just bowler this thing to get a bit more of an example. Never mind, I don't have a bowler. Okay, so the kick to the head. This is what makes Equuses just great. They are amazing for knocking stuff out. Okay, then just kick. Almost out, I guess. I mean, one more dart and it would be out probably. I missed. So yeah. For a headshot, 115 damage, that's pretty decent if you ask me. Now let's test it out on the other horses. Here we go. Just start knocking this thing out. 38 damage, that's not bad. Now let's test out the bite on another horse. Never mind, wait, I was about to cut. But, found another horse. Hey boy, follow me. Oh, uh, <laughs> didn't mean to do that at all. Uh, okay. Well, I mean, I have a test dummy in my base. I can show you guys the damage. Okay, we're almost at base. And we're at base. Okay, then just 
drop the quest down, land my wyvern, and let's test out the damage of this thing. Can I mount? Thank you. Okay, so for the bite, this thing deal 31 damage. Not that bad. I mean, it's okay, it's bad, but it's pretty good for horse. Now for the butt kick. 38. Like, how much does that actually... I mean, that could deal a lot of torpor so This thing is actually very good. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And this is how to tame an equus. And I'll see you guys in the next one.